how to add shipping to Square website. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to add shipping to your Square website. So basically it is going to be very easy and simple. We're going to head over square.com or squareup.com, sign in for an account, and then we're going to find this dashboard. As usual, we are going to head over the left side of the screen, click on online, then we are going to choose online store. From here, we are going to wait for the uh, dashboard of the website to uh, open up. And we are going basically to have the elements for the website. Now, what are we going to do is to head over the fulfillment. Basically, we are going to find pickup and delivery and also shipping. Click on shipping and wait for a few seconds. It is going to guide you to this process. So we are going to have the shipping from, for example, like that. You're going to put your address, email address, the phone number, etc. Because these are going to be crucial. In my case, this is not going to be a real address because I have put a random phone number and also a, a not personal uh, email address. So you need to make sure that you're going to put your own information. You can edit them at any time because they are going to be crucial. So you're going to click on go to shipment and in account and settings. So from here, you're going to set up everything. So we're going to have the fulfillment method like the shipping labels. You can go ahead and set up the printable uh, right there. You can add the shipping for square online. So you're going to have the online inventory and shipping rate profits. And also you can add a rate or shipping rate profiles from here. So here we are going to be back. Sometimes they have set up some, uh, let's say buttons that will take you and get you back to the same page. So here we have the shipping rate profiles. So you're going to add a profile like that. Put the profile details like the type, if it is going to be an order or an item, basically it is going to be all for the orders. The profile name, you're going to give it here. The countries, for example, you can add the countries or select the countries. For example, I'm going to put this only for the US like that. And uh, I can go ahead and add more. So for the rates, I can go ahead and add a, a rate name and also the type of the rate. Maybe a flat rate of rate per order like that. And the fee is going to be uh, 20 like that dollar and we are going to put it as standard maybe like that click done and boom we are going to click on save so the profile name is going to be us i'm going to put it like this and here you have it that was pretty much it for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one